And I do this like seven days out of the week I And I grind so hard I don't get much sleep I had to earn my stripes So I don't have to work no nine five Yeah, we be taking everything for granted, no lie What's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel Today I will be doing a clean with me If you guys need a little bit of inspiration A little bit of motivation All you gotta do is stay tuned and subscribe to the channel And I will show you guys how I clean my kids room and plus everyone's been sick so i'm going to go ahead and disinfect everything what's up everyone like i said today is a motivational cleaning video i will be deep cleaning and disinfecting my entire house the only place i will not be able to get to in this video is my bedroom if you guys are new here make sure y'all go ahead and subscribe and hit the thumbs up button and comment down below what is the most difficult place in your house to clean now, you guys, let's get to this kitchen. I had so much stuff in here. Halloween just happened and it was just like, everything was just everywhere, okay? So first, I'm just gonna start by getting everything up off the counters and putting it back into its rightful place. As you guys know, if you're following me on my Jazzy Life, I plan on expanding my YouTube business. So I plan on getting some more shelving put into my garage. That way everything is organized and so it's not so difficult for me to find certain things that I plan on using. So you guys, look at all this stuff that's on my counter. I have dishes to do. I have to set up my security system. It's a lot as you guys can see, but I'm gonna go ahead and get it all done, okay? So I did pick up a few extra cleaning products to use today. Um, if you're following me on my Jazzy Life, like I said, then you would know what I got over there. I have tons and tons of diaper bags and purses just sitting over here by my desk. This has become my catch it all spot behind my couch, which sucks, but I'm working on trying to declutter that area and get organized as far as, you know, my office area. You guys can see here i'm going to go ahead and take care of all the dishes i'm just going to go ahead and rinse them out before tossing them in the dishwasher i hate dishes and that's why i utilize my dishwasher some people say girl you're lazy for using dishwasher well let me be lazy over here you take your time and wash all them dishes one dish at a time i remember back when i did not own a dishwasher you guys it was h -E double hockey sticks okay it was hell and I washed dishes and bottles for hours. So once I got a house that actually had a dishwasher, it was a game changer for me. But of course, I still go ahead and rinse everything off before placing it into a dishwasher. So something that I don't tell you guys, so what I do with my old washcloths, like old towels, I use them to clean the house, okay? Sometimes they don't turn back white, sometimes they do, whether I use bleach, whether I use vinegar, at the end of the day, I use them all for the same thing, it's to wipe down the countertops. How I see it, if I wash and disinfect that towel, then at the end of the day, it's still reusable. Mm -hmm. Say what you want, this is my channel, this is my cleaning video. And this is my realistic cleaning video. All right, enough about the washcloths. Now let's go on to Legendary's bottle rack and of course his cleaning brushes. I like to disinfect these a lot because it can build up and you can get a lot of water residue in between the grass and of course the little plate at the bottom. So I like to throw it into some bleach and soapy water and let it sit for a little while just so it can get all the buildup off. All right, you guys, now it's time to sweep. I'm going to sweep. As you guys can see, I got a pot on the stove and it's boiling some hot water. 
so that I can, like I said, mop my floors. I usually use my Swiffer and of course I use my Steam Mop, but today I'm bringing out the old fashioned Spin Mop, okay? Because look, it gets the job done. It gets your floors nice and clean. And yeah, if you don't have one, I highly recommend that you get one. They have newer ones out and I'm really considering about getting the new one that I've seen at HEB. It's like a Gain Spin Mop. Yes, y'all, game changer when it comes to mopping. All right, you guys, now it's time to get to mopping. I'm about to mix my bleach, my Fabulosa. Look, my house smells amazing. I love Fabulosa because it keeps all of the spiders away, especially the lavender scent. So I highly recommend y'all get the lavender scent. It keeps spiders away. And honestly, we've been having a lot, a lot of ants, and I'm so over this ant problem. The pest control came out, and they took care of our ants, but look, they still keep coming back. I think it's just because it's been hot the hot weather and things like that here in Texas. It's just like the weather's confused here, okay? One day is hot, one day is cold. So the bugs is just as confused. They're like, okay, so what is it? What is it today? But your girl's about to go ahead and mop the kitchen. And of course, I did clean the bathroom off camera. If y'all want to see that, I kind of went and did that on TikTok. I did like a little short video over there. I do need to get rid of all these boxes, y'all. Some of these boxes are presents and stuff like that. I, I need to just move it off, but one thing at a time. So we're just going to go ahead and clean this house, okay? So comment down below, what cleaning products do you use to mop your floor? Do you? I know everybody probably uses bleach, but what else do you add into your mop water? All right, you guys, like I said, my kids stay sick. They come home sick. They put cooties everywhere. So I'm going to first start by disinfecting Legendary's playpen. I'm disinfecting this because not only do Legend be in the playpen, but the older kids come over here and play with him. I know people was like, your kids are too big to be in the playpen. Look, they like to come over here and play with their little brother, and that is totally fine with me. But at the same time, we need to disinfect and make sure everything is clean for Legendary so he doesn't get sick. So with that said, I'm going to wipe down all his toys, especially since he likes to put things in his mouth and just wipe down the playpen, take the rug out, wipe down his bouncers, wipe down his walker, just get everything all clean. Okay, now that I finished cleaning up the living room area, I'm gonna head into the girls' room. So I actually already washed their sheets. I'm just gonna go ahead and just spray some disinfecting spray. This is some disinfecting fabric spray. I'm spraying their toys, wiping down their tablets. The thing that they use the most is these tablets, child. Wipe down them tablets, wiping down Amaya's desk. Anything that I feel like the kids are playing with the most, I'm gonna wipe it down. Hey, I 
So one thing I really enjoy doing, I feel like it's really satisfying, is vacuuming the kids' room because I just love a nice, freshly vacuumed room which with their carpet, just all the lines. Y'all know how I am. But anyways, I just took Aiden's sheets out of the wash and I put them on his bed. As y'all saw, I am not taking care of those clothes today. Look at that, laundry. Nuh-uh, no, not doing it, not doing it. Um, the basket, I don't know why Aiden puts it under here, but you know what? I think I'm gonna get him a basket and just keep it under here because he likes to put his clothes under there. But as for Kayla's room, her room is pretty much always clean. She cleans her room pretty good, makes her bed. She's, she's, she's older, okay? So you're gonna see less of a mess on the floor. However, just because there's no mess does not mean that there isn't germs. So I went ahead and wiped down her desk, wiped down her keyboard, mouse, anything that she touches, I just wiped it all down. I did that off camera because my camera died, but You guys, finished look. Look at the lines. Aiden's room is totally clean. His room is always clean. Here are the girls' room, clean. I keep their nighttime bags that they go to their dad's house under their beds. And the bathroom was clean. I did that on TikTok, okay? Kitchen clean. Y'all give your girl a thumbs up. Don't be sitting back in the bushes just watching. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to share. Share my video. Share with everybody. Look how beautiful it looks in here, y'all. And it's amazingly clean. All right, you guys, so I pretty much cleaned the entire house, but our room, that's just gonna be for another day because it's already three o'clock and I have to go get the kids from the bus stop in 20 minutes. So that was a good, relaxing cleaning video. This house smells so amazing, okay? I love it whenever I get a deep clean in. Um, just dedicate the whole day to just cleaning. So I hope you guys enjoyed this cleaning video. If you did, thumbs up and subscribe. If you already new, welcome to my channel and I will see you guys in our next video.